So, who wants to hear a funny story? I know I do. I've been in Hong Kong, got home with a little bit of money left. So I bought another guitar from Artist Guitars, and in this video, we're going to unbox it. This is Artist Guitars TC59, which is their version of the Telecaster. And here is the guitar. Bring it out. This guitar's got some weight to it. Ooh, we got cool picks this time. We got simple black ones. In our last video, we got some cool, nice little plectrums there. So we've got the lead. Oh, we've got a cool lead too. Perfect. Anyway, here is the guitar. So as I said, this is the TC59, and this comes with um, ball bucker pickups, which are the same on their LP59, and it's their version of the humbuckers. Let's go ahead um, and put it up here. Okay, so here we are. Um, this already feels amazing. It is quite um, sturdy, um, but I just want to quickly go over a couple of features of it, um, and we will get rid of this tape, which will be quite, hopefully, I'm going to try and make that cinematic. But um, here is the guitar. I've been playing with the guitar now for quite a while and I want to go over uh, three major sounds that this guitar has. Each of these sounds I want to be using uh, with the coil pickup and without as well. Now I'm going to be using the new X Mighty 20BT amplifier which I got from Artist Guitars as well. Um, and I do have an, un an unboxing of that amplifier and also an LP59 guitar um, on my channel already. Uh, but anyway, let's go ahead and start with a uh, clean tone with the neck pickup. is the same pickup but with the coil tapping instead. Now I want to move to a lead uh, to a rock sound and I want to be using the bridge pickup uh, coil tapping is uh, down and this is what it sounds like <laughs> with the coil tapping. Now we're going to do a lead tone with a little bit of delay and we're going to use the bridge pickup Again, we're starting as we have before without the coil tapping. And this is what the lead tone sounds like.
coil tapping. So this guitar is the TC59, that is the model that it has made. I just want to quickly go over the tech features. So the body wood is American Ash, and it looks amazing, I might add. The machine heads are improved locking machine heads, which are definitely a bargain um, for only $269, which is what this guitar is going for at the moment. The finish is a blonde gloss. The neck is a 22 fret maple fingerboard with a sat finish bone nut. The nut width is 41 millimeters and it is a C-shaped neck. The bridge is a modern style TC bridge with brass saddles. Pickups are the humbucker, bullbucker pickups with chrome covers. And the th main features are that this has a three-way switch, coil tapping, string through bod body, which means better wiring shielding. So that is going to wrap it up for this video. Thank you all so much for watching. Uh, would I recommend this guitar? I definitely would. It is a cheap, extremely good quality um, guitar. Now, if you did enjoy this unboxing, please go ahead and check out my LP59 Artist Guitar Unboxing, which is also up on this channel, uh, where I unbox the LP59 and also the amp that I've been using, which is the new X20 BT um, amplifier. Uh, but that is it. Thank you all so much for watching. Have any questions, comments, queries, anything like that, comment down in the section below. If you did enjoy it, please leave a like, subscribe, all that stuff. But thank you all for watching. That's it from me, Taz Venom. Yeah. Hope to see every one of you in the next video. Bye.